Hi guys! So today I am back with a new video. I'm not feeling the best, my throat really hurts, and I just haven't been having a good day. But you know, I still gotta get a video out for you. I'm so sorry if the quality isn't as best as it should be. I'm currently filming on my phone because I lost the charger to my camera and I was so frustrated, but I was like, let me just film on my phone. Okay, so today I'm going to be doing this challenge. It's called like makeup using food challenge and I saw one of my favorite YouTubers. Her name is Sarah Basca. She did it and it was so funny. So I think I'm going to try the same thing. So without further ado, let's get on with the video. Okay, hi guys, I'm back. And basically, I'm going to have to take off my glasses and I'm really sorry that you have to see this and whatever. So first off, we're going to use this brand. It's called... um. Nutella. I'm not sure if you know what it's called, but it's called Nutella, and I'm going to be using it as a foundation. Um, Nutella. I don't. I don't really use brushes. You really just gotta get it on there. Um, I'm using this as my foundation, so we're just gonna take a little bit of product and put it as if you're putting foundation on. Nutella is really smooth. You know, got a good like base. Oh gosh. Okay. And now we're just gonna like really get that on the skin. And you just really gotta massage it in there because the brand Nutella they have like really good stuff I really like their stuff and pretty much they're just gonna really get it in there like that sorry if my like eye goes crazy today because I'm not wearing my glasses but make sure you get everywhere under the eyes on the nose in between just even on the eyebrows because we can do some stuff with that later and don't forget to blend down the neck so like because full coverage is really what we're looking for here and I love this one because it's really full coverage if you can't tell get blend by the ear blend down the neck okay so like yeah that's the that's basically our foundation. It's Nutella. And pretty much now we're gonna do what I like to call it's called concealer. Cause you know, now that the foundation's looking popping, we gotta get some fun concealer in there. I'm using this all natural, it's called um creamy peanut boutier. Like and I'm just getting a little bit of that and I'm gonna make the the triangles under my eyes and then you gotta get a little bit of that on here and some on like the just do it like the way you usually do it and pretty much that's where it is so just keep doing that just like all the beauty gear is on YouTube you really gotta make sure you like blend it out don't blend it out too much because you still gotta see the concealer you know what I'm talking about. So now, once you've done that, we're going to move on to eyeshadow. But I'm going to be right back, so I just got to clean my fingers off a bit. Okay. So now, I'm going to be using this powder eyeshadow. It's called Domino. Domino? I'm pretty sure it's called Domino Sugar. And I'm just going to take like a pinch of the powder. Because this is like loose eyeshadow pigments. So I'm going to take some of the pigments. And I'm just going to. So after taking the Domino powder. And just really getting it. On my eye. You can see like the look is really coming together. Because Domino is like one of my most trusted brands. Like I'm shouting them out. Hashtag not spawns. I really like Domino. Anyways, Domino, like, they should sponsor because, like, I'm saying such good stuff about their products, but I can't not. It's so good. So, as you can see, I'm just doing a very simple, one-colored look. Oh my god, you guys, look at that. Elsa makeup. And this foundation is really holding up. I know I didn't put any primer today, 
That's because it's a quick look. And anyways, now I'm going to be doing my blush. So I'm going to be using this Hershey Syrah in Strawberry. You just put a tiny double like on the did, like that. It's really pink and peachy, which is nice. Oh my god, guys, look at that peach. Okay, so I need a little bit more Hershey syrup, but strawberry. And I'm just going to keep applying that on here until it blends out the way I want it to. This a little bit goes a long way for Hershey because as you can tell, this blush makes me look so happy. It's like if you're depressed, you know how it is. Put a little bit of Hershey syrup on your face, strawberry. And you pretty much look like the happiest person in the world. I'm like Hershey syrup. My lazy eye is working on overtime right now because my glasses are off and it's not used to it. But this Hershey Syrah, just like, ugh, guys, you need to try it. And it has this little drippy effect it likes to do. And yeah, we're going to do the contour and I'm using another one of Hershey Syrah's products. This is in Hunya Chocolat Flavor. Chocolate, that's obviously chocolate. Um, taking a little bit of Hershey Syrah, just a tiny bit, because this one's a lot thicker. But I'm using it to carve out my face. Oh my god, guys, look at that. See that sound? Ooh, guys, look at that. And I'm just gonna contour my nose. Just like nose, you know how to contour that. And then you just gotta contour like the sides of your face, your temples, kind of. Okay. So like you guys, we're looking really good right now. And I'm also gonna use this Hershey Syrah Chukla to do my eyebrows. Because it works so well and the color just like matches my eyebrows perfectly. So I'm gonna get a little bit closer to you now. And I'm just gonna really just work in my eyebrows. Can I say eyebrows on fleek? I know the contour isn't like blended out the most now, but like we're looking for a very unnatural look. So I was gonna. Oh, and as you saw in my first video, I'm all about jawline. So we're gonna need a little more for the jawline. Mm. Oh, guys, look at that. Yep, just like my first video. Perfect. And. Mm. Mm. You guys, I'm thinking about becoming the new beauty guru. Okay. Anyways, so now the eyebrows are done, just like before. And you're thinking, I think it looks over. Girl, honey, you freaking wish. So now we're going to move on to lips. So as a base, I'm going to be using Honey, Honey's new lip. I'm kind of using it as like a, a gloss undertone for the next thing. So just, just a double because... This stuff is really important. You just gotta. I love Hanae's products. But. We're gonna be using this as our lip product for today. It's called Welch's. Welch's? I think you say Welch's. And I'm using it in color Grape Jelly. So I'm just gonna take a little bit. It's a pretty thick product. You're gonna see soon. That you only need a little bit. So I'm taking the Welch's and I'm mixing it with strawberry to create the lip color I'm going for today. Which is mm, Welch's and strawberry look really nice together. And like all these products are all natural. Like they're so natural you could eat it if you wanted. And that concludes our look. Okay guys, so basically... Okay guys, you can clearly see that my look is so attractive for like a day out. Like, hey girl, hey girl, how you doing? But, whatever. So like, I can see the look, cause like, I'm pretty much blind. So. Oh my god. This is what attractive looks like, ladies. Like, you can pick up any guy with a look like this. And I call this my night out look, like bloody vampire. 
I need a little bit more Welch, yes. I let. This is like our original, like, like Kylie Lip Bumper. Hey, my beauty goose. I'm gonna thank you so much for watching. Um, tell me if you want more of this, and I'll give it to you basically because I'm just really good at this. Like, oh my god, I can't stop looking at myself. Well, doesn't matter. Let's just get this video to 500 million likes. Don't forget to subscribe to Ready for the Cringes channel. And basically, I'll see you beauty cues next week. And I hope you have a great Sunday. Kisses.